friends, how are you? I'm so excited to be with you today. I'm so sorry I couldn't see you last week, but I was feeling so sick and all my friends took care of me and I heard they took care of you and read you some stories and I heard you saw Moo Moo. Well, today I have a story for you about spring because we're talking about the birds and the flowers and all the fun stuff that is outside and changing for the season of spring. So I have a book. It's called I See Spring. It is by Charles Ginna and the pictures were drawn by Ag Jatskawa. That's a big, big name. And it's by Picture Window Books. I see spring. Look, there's some beautiful flowers. I heard that you have been looking at different colors. And oh my goodness, we're seeing all the beautiful colors. I see some red and yellow and orange and green and blue and purple and yellow and pink. There's all kinds of colors that we have learned this year. This says, I see raindrops falling down. And do you know what? I just saw some raindrops falling down. There was wind and rain, and now it's beautiful and sunny. Can you believe it? <clears throat> I see raincoats blue and brown. <gasps> Look at this. I see dark clouds way up high. That's what I saw. I see a rainbow in the sky. Did anybody go out and look for a rainbow? I didn't even think about it. I see puddles in the street. I see rain boots on my feet. Gosh, isn't it fun to put on boots and jump in some puddles, even if they're a little muddy? I see sunshine on the trees. I see bluebirds in the breeze. I see robins build a nest. I see bunnies take a rest. I see ladybugs and snails. I see puppy dogs chasing their tails. I see yellow daffodils. I had some of those. I see bluebells on the hills. They're a pretty kind of flower. I don't think I've ever seen one of those in real life. I see squirrels scamper on the ground. I see pinwheels go round and round. I see kites high up in the sky. I see clothes hanging up to dry. I see butterflies and flowers. I see signs of more spring showers. Oh, what signs do you see? I see a cloud that might bring a spring shower and some puddles that were left over from before and maybe a little bit of, of wind there. Oh, and here comes some raindrops. The end. Wasn't that a nice story? And we saw all of our colors. How exciting. I even saw brown. Look at that. Brown here. Brown here. How exciting for all of our colors. I have a spring song to sing with you. It goes like this. We have to do some motions. Can you do them with me? First, we have to make the wind. Go like this. And then we have to make grass. You just kind of twinkle some grass out of your fingers. And then we have to make a tree. I, I, I'm like way back, so I'll lean back like this, make a tree. And then we have to make a flower. And we have to make some bees. And bees go like this, buzz. And you have to really do that one. You have to make busy bumblebees, buzz. And then we have to make robins, those pretty birds that fly around in our yard. And then the robins are gonna sing with cheer. And you have to go like this. You have to put your, your fingers up and you have to say, wake up. And you gotta yell it. Wake up. Springtime is here. So ready? Let's try it together. You can stop and do this with me if you want, or we can just try it all together. Ready? It goes like this. The wind told the grass 
And the grass told the trees, the trees told the flowers, and the flowers told the bees. Bzzz. The bees told the robins, and the robins sang with cheer. Wake up! Wake up! Springtime is here! And if mom and dad want you to look at that again, and you can yell out the bee part without getting in trouble, or yell out the robin part without getting in trouble, that would be super fun too. I would love to see a video of you if mom and dad want to take a picture of you doing um, the bees and the birds. That would be so much fun. Hey friends, I miss you so much and you know I love you so much. And in a couple of days, maybe we'll take a look at some more colors and see what we know or some numbers and we'll see how smart you are. But I am so excited that I get to um, be with you today and please ask mom and dad to send me some pictures of you or some videos of you on our dojo. So, okay, I will talk to you next time. And you know what I always say at the end, ready? Say, I love you. And I do. I'll see you soon. Bye.